February 14th. Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. I'm going to have uh, pumpkin for dessert. <laughs> okay, everybody. <laughs> uh, I decided to, that I wanted something for dessert. And I was going to go drive five miles into town to the bakery there and get some pumpkin pie or cherry pie or something just to treat myself. And I felt I didn't feel like driving that far, so I looked in my cupboard, which I have lots of, lots of stuff, eh? Couldn't find anything sweet other than there's some fruit, cans of fruit in there, but I found a can. Oops! <laughs> I found this can here. A pumpkin. Where's the label? There. Raw pumpkin. Pure pumpkin. Pure pumpkin. I had to take the label off because there's a recipe to make pumpkin pie. So it says uh, half a can. Oh. Half a can. Half a can makes one pie. So I need two eggs. cup of brown sugar, teaspoon of ground cinnamon, half a teaspoon of nutmeg and a quarter of a teaspoon of ginger. Okay, I don't have that, but I got the, the salt, a quarter of a teaspoon of salt, and three quarter cups of evaporated milk. I got that. Okay, so, and a frozen deep dish pie shell. <laughs> I don't have one. So, hang loose. I'm going to whip all this up. Okay. Two eggs. One. Two. Cinnamon. And a half a teaspoon. I think that's what it said. Half a teaspoon. Uh, can't read French. I hate that. Oh, a whole teaspoon. A whole teaspoon. That's got to be a teaspoon. Now it says for a cup, a cup of brown sugar. Well, there's no way I put that much sugar in. I quit buying white sugar 30 years ago. I always use honey, but I don't mind a little bit of brown sugar because it's apparently pure um, cane. It says right on the thing there, pure cane sugar. So, I have some of that Oop. here. So instead of a, a cup, I put like three tablespoons in. That's probably like half a cup. Here, I'll put in four. That's probably half a cup. I don't like stuff that sweet anyway. So put in a half a cup. And Whew. Put the eggs in, yeah. And uh, half a can of pumpkin. Half a can. Got out of the way. Got to find a fork. Yeah. It says to mix it all up, break the eggs, mix all this up, sugar, pumpkin, eggs, da da da, da da da, I think you can see it, I don't know. There, use this to 
trying to loosen up on anything that's stuck on the side there. This is doing it the minimalist way, eh? <laughs> I got the generator going in the background, that's why it's a little loud because I got the oven on and I heated up some uh, coconut oil. Anyway, my smoke alarm went off, so I turned on the fan. I put the generator on, so I got electricity, so I turned on the fan. Okay, that's pretty well mixed, nice. Now it says to add oh, three quarters of a cup of evaporated milk, which I happen to have. Three quarters of a cup. <laughs> oh, there's a cup. Okay, so three cup, three quarters of a cup. Should be up to that line there. That's about three quarters of a cup. Don't mind the mess, folks. I'm a single man. You know us, we don't really give a shit too much. We don't sweat the small stuff. I'll get around to it. I'll clean a little bit up later. <laughs> All right. Okay. Now it says to whip in the, the milk. Boy, that looks runny. That's what it says. Three quarters of a cup. So I don't have any nutmeg or ginger, but it doesn't require much anyway, so I'll just uh, do with the uh, cinnamon. Whoops. Mix it up fairly good. Plenty sweet enough, that's for sure. Did good. Huh. Okay, so I don't have a I don't have a pie plate or anything like that. I don't have any pie crust, so I'm just going to put it in this frying pan, which I uh, coated earlier with. Yeah, I don't know. I coated earlier with uh, coconut oil, as I said there. Um, or maybe I didn't say. <laughs> yeah. But this is going to be a pumpkin pie filling dessert. It's just a pumpkin pie without the crust. That over there. Just uh, put it in the oven. Don't ask us. Since I put it at full glass, 475 for 10 minutes or so. Ah, I don't know if I can adjust the camera now a little bit. the oven going. Oh. And I'm going to put it right in there. I have to remember to, uh, luckily I had a frying pan that has no uh, rubber on the handle or any shit like that, so I can bake it. So it says 4, 475 for 15 minutes and then turn it down. Probably don't even need to have it that hot because that's probably to give the crust a, a good cooking and then the uh, and then the filling cooks afterwards. So I might just turn it down sooner and we'll put it at uh, so just to cook at 350 for a half an hour or 35 minutes or until a knife 
inserted in the center comes out clean. <laughs> so, bake at 425 oh, for 15 minutes. Turn that down a bit. I got it at 475. So now it's at 425. Let's uh, see how that turns out. I'm not going to leave the camera on for that. Okay, it's done. It's a little crooked, but I don't care. Oh. There it is. Blah, 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 blah. There. There we go. I let it cool off. Might be a little crooked, but there it is. Oh, yummy, yummy. It's not too sweet. I was right just using a couple of tablespoons. You can make it sweeter if you want. This is delicious. So there's my pumpkin dessert. <laughs> pumpkin pie without the, the shell, that's all. Do it in a frying pan. Well, you do it in a whatever you want. You can do it in the oven. I was going to just try it on the stove, but then I remembered I had an oven. So, <laughs> anyway, damn, you know what? I did this so I wouldn't have to go down to the bakery to, make, to get a dessert. Ascom's hair. It's everywhere. I should have, um, I gotta go to the grocery store now and buy some whipped cream. Because how can you have pumpkin pie without whipped cream? Son of a bitch. But boy, is it good. So, I just had a shave. While I had my shave with my new Larry's razor that I got at Walmart, um, um, which by the way, Larry's.com, you can buy the damn thing online. It works out cheaper, I think. It's $8 for the razor, $2 per cartridge, and free delivery, and they got the gel, and yeah, everything there. So. I know where I'm going to get, when I need my razor, it's like squat line and order them. I just jiggled the camera there. Um, I was thinking, now i got a half a can of pumpkin, what am I going to do with that? I'll have to make that again, or I'll add it to my soup. That's all i got to do is, I, get, I always make chicken soup, beef soup, whatever. Almost every night I have some kind of a soup. So... Um, I'm going to add that half a pumpkin to my next uh, soup with my vegetables and uh, see how that turns out.
<laughs> this is the things they've been warning us about. These little Supposed to be careful we don't touch those little blue things. Those are uh, jellyfish. Some kind of jellyfish. Oh, here's a big white one. Apparently, if you step on them or pick them up, it's gonna be hurting. Look at these little guys. I guess they're seagulls of some sort. What's the matter, guy? <laughs> yeah. They're big seagulls. Yeah, I'm coming, Esther. Busy on the beach today. Busy, busy today. Such a nice day. It's about 72 degrees now. 68 and maybe at the coldest. What a lovely day. <laughs> 